This style of video making is called experiential. It means that whatever I choose to share is whatever my viewer gets. Sorry, viewer. Um, so this Lego medium motor is broken. But when you have a broken motor, it doesn't mean it's useless because it's useful in that now we have the freedom to open it up and see what it looks like inside. And so we're going to do that. But first, we'll turn off the camera so that we can spend some time figuring out how to open it. Okay, here we go. So how did you open it? So there's these notches that you could have pushed in. However, I took the brute force approach and scraped it off with a <laughs> screwdriver. And uh, now it's uh, partially open. And once but I do it- But this is not the broken one. It doesn't say broken on it. It's not? Oh. What happened to the broken one? <laughs> what did happen to the broken did one? Did you rub off broken? <laughs> did I? I think you must have. Or? Did or. I use the wrong one? We got both sides off. Yep, we got both sides off. Now so. we're gonna open it and see what's inside. It's a motor. Yep. Yeah. And a washer. And some gears. Yep, some three gears. Three gears. Oh, wait, 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 let's take a picture of those gears. Oh, wait. What else is there? Bye, guys. Bye. Yep, uh, it was pretty much like the gearbox part. Can I make an instruction for Peggy? Uh, sure. Here's the, uh, Hang on. like, plastic casing. And then this, we might be yep. able to reconstitute this. Um, if we cut it off somewhere. Because it holds the connector. That's what I'm thinking anyway. Yeah, maybe we could replace this motor. Uh, oh, yeah, this. that's a good idea. And then put it all back together. Mm -hmm. I have a... Full naked uh, motor and soldering. I'm at the circuit board. Mm. Still has the port and... Uh, yeah. So we're trying to think about whether we could replace that one with this one that we happen to have in the cupboard. And it sort of seems to be the same size, except it does have these capacitors and a resist. Oh, that's a diode on it. And then, um, and this is bigger, but maybe we could replace this with this. I don't know exactly how this works, but um, it's a motor. so. Either that or we put it in the to-be-fixed box forever. <laughs> this so this is it. the top right here. Okay. This goes... No, oh, right. This this is the back. Okay, so... Like so. This goes... Back. Are we missing one? This one oh, and yes. this. Yes. So... Should go like... Ooh. It's gonna be tricky. <laughs> I don't know how they ever make these in the first place, you know? <laughs> what do they do? There must be like some short-term glue, you know? You put it on and it sticks everything for a bit and then it disappears.